Hi guys, um, I really really hope you can hear me. Um, I'm filming in my bathroom um, because I wanted like the sink and stuff when I do this but this is basically what I do um, if I've got makeup on like full face makeup and I want to take it off and I want to go to bed like I will do this every single every single day. It doesn't have to be full face even if I'm just coming home from work this is basically what I do with my face. So the first thing I want to do is put my hair up. So it doesn't need to look very good. We're just going to stick it on the top of our heads. Okay, next thing I'm going to do is grab a face wipe. So I'm just going to use a, like, a random one from the top shop that I have purchased not that long ago. And this is to kind of get rid of like the majority of the makeup. Um, so I'm just going to show you like in real time how long it takes me to do this. And this is just to kind of get rid of like the lipstick and the concealer and I'd say the majority. That's disgusting. But, and I know a lot of people just use like their face wipe and then go to sleep, but I cannot do that. Like I really cannot do that. That's not removing the makeup, it's just like removing the surface stuff. So now that like most of it is gone, we'll just throw that face wipe in the bin. And this is basically why we wear makeup, because otherwise we look like this. So that's going to go to the bin. And then I'm going to wash my face. Uh, face wash I'm using at the moment is my Tea Tree Skin Clearing one. So I'm going to wash my face now. I'm just going to take some on my little hand. I always wash my face twice. One, like, you know, to, to again get rid of like the rest of the makeup, and then the second time just to like, um, just really cleanse the skin. I do have bad skin, it's oily, it's acne prone, which is why I use the tea tree wash or the clean and clear it one. And then like I said I'll go in with another, I'll wash it again just because that's like the majority of the stuff gone. And look at my under eye circles, how bad they are. I don't think anyone really wants to watch this but I'm going to do it anyway. You can see how bright that lipstick is, it's left like a stain. Right, I'm going to wash that off and then I'm going to pat my face dry with a towel. Don't rub hard, just pat. Push my hair out my way. I can't believe how many people are going to watch this. Okay, then you want to tone. So you take one of these and one of these. I'm using the uh, Seaweed Clarifying Toner by The Body Shop for combination to oily skin. And this will just help tighten my pores and remove any last traces of oil from my skin before I moisturize. You see some of my lipsticks come off. I'm not tugging very hard, I'm just swiping this across. Okay, 
And then once that's dry it off a little bit. And then I'm gonna go in with my moisturizer. I pretty much do the same thing in the morning, apart from I just miss out the face wipe bit. I do exactly the same thing in the morning, but I use a different face cream. So I'm gonna go in with my Body Shop Naturalift Firming Night Cream in this little red container. It's really nice and thick and it basically makes my skin feel amazing in the morning. And then we're just gonna rub that in. Rub, rub, rub. I'm so sorry about that buzzing noise. It's like the ventilation right above my head. God, I needed a sink for this tutorial, so. And as you know, I don't edit, so the camera has to come with me. I don't have a clue how to edit. I'm like the thickest person ever. And then, I do use a night cream, but I've forgotten to get it from my room. It's the Benefit Icon, which I'll probably put on after this video, but I just pat it on like that with my ring fingers. But it's Benefit Icon, I think it's called at the moment. The last thing I do is put some spot treatment on while I go to bed. And it's the Freedom Spot Treatment, and it's just in this little tube. And I have got some bad boys at the moment that just need a bit of drying up. And you can see like two down there. That's the birthmark by the way, that's always been there. I don't know why I just put cream on it like it was going to disappear. And I've got a whopper up there just brewing. And then I will basically go to sleep like this. That is it. That's basically like my bedtime routine for my face. So I'll see you in the next video and thanks for watching. If you have any questions, leave them below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can.